More than 300,000 fans have already walked through the U.S. Open gates this year, but not everyone who goes there is a huge tennis fan. That's okay. Yeah. New Cell's Kevin Marr put together a guide to the Open for those folks, too. There's a chance a million people could attend the U.S. Open this year. That's a lot of fans watching the world's best players on the nation's biggest stage. But what do you do here if you're not a tennis fan or you're just like tennis out? What do you do? Plenty. Follow me. First, you can grab a ball and play yeah. at the USTA Play Tennis Area. It's a mini court where fans can show off their skills. Experience, not necessary. Chutzpah, that helps. Are you ready to take on the pros? Probably. Nice, I love the confidence. If all of that playing makes you hungry, trust me, the Open has got you covered. It offers seven restaurants and 77 concession stands. We're talking burgers, barbecue, and bowls, oh my. This is a, a brisket burger. Uh, very, very good food. I've never had a bad meal here. Or you can go around and take photos, like with the big logo. You could take one with this big racket. Yeah! You could take one with a big star. Smile, Novak. Or you can take a selfie with one of the biggest people here. You ready? You can also go shopping for the latest US Open gear and then top off your day with the Open's signature drink, the Honey Deuce. A blend of vodka, lemonade, raspberry liqueur, and melon balls that fans say taste like... Summer. Summer. That's a good answer. And so it's game on for the players, and now time for you to get on in here. And we'll see you at the U.S. Open. Kevin Marr, News 12.